anyways. As I was saying... Hey, uh, other dwarf planets. Ah, uh, what do you want? Uh, who said that? My name is Sedna, and these are my colleagues, Warwar, Orcus, and Gonga. No way! More dwarf planets? I've heard legends of others like us somewhere in the Kuiper Belt, but I never... We don't have time! They're coming! They? Who's they? The Rogue Planets. <sighs> what is it, Sedna? Planet X has now entered the Oort Cloud. Oh, so he's really leaving? Seems that way. Hmm. You know, this could mean trouble if they... I know! Call the others. Gong Gong! Gong Gong! Gong Gong! Gong Gong! Uh, gong, gong, gong. Hey, bud, listen. Gong, gong, gong. Yes, I missed you too. Hey, have you seen Orcus? Gong. Sedna's summoning us. There's a situation. Gong, 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 gong. Planet X left the solar system. Oort Cloud and all. We need to summon the team and discuss our next steps. Because if he meets anyone, we'll all be in big trouble. Gong, gong. Hey, Orcus. Sedna! What? Why are you out of your post? Because the situation warrants it. What situation? X has left the solar system. X as in? Planet X. Gong Gong. Hold up! You think he's gonna meet the rogues? It's a guarantee. But he's not the first planet to leave our solar system. Yes, but he has a direct connection to most of the solar system's planets. I wouldn't be surprised if they wanted to use him. Use them for what? We don't even know them! We know enough. We know that beyond the Earth Cloud, it's not our territory. But theirs. Come. Explain it to us one more time! Ugh, but I've explained it to you like 20 times! Sorry, I was distracted by the fact that you guys exist! Uh, can anyone explain what's the deal with Red over here? Maki Maki gets very excited when he meets new dwarf planets. I guess meeting four in a row is sort of overkill. Anyways, as I said, we don't have time. The rogue planets are coming. Do you know this for certain? Excuse me? You mentioned Planet X left the solar system. Then you took a huge leap in logic and assumed he'll meet this secret society of so-called rogue planets and... Come for us all? Look, while you guys are playing your little games, we have been guarding the solar system from external forces. We spread across the Kuiper Belt and beyond so we always know who is coming or leaving. You've got to be kidding me. She's not. I, for example, was tasked to orbit opposite to you, Pluto. My name is Orcus, but I'm also known as Anti-Pluto. Listen, guys. Do we even know if these rogue planets exist? Gong gong, gong gong, gong gong, gong gong! Uh, come again? He said that it's a mathematical certainty that there are countless rogue planets roaming the space between solar systems. And some of them come close to our system, which is why we stand guard. Well, I seriously doubt those rogue planets exist, and if they do, I doubt they even care enough to come here. Then let's give them a reason. Triton? Hey, bud, it's been so long. Tell me about it. I don't remember us being so many. Hey, what do you mean by let's give them a reason? I mean that the situation has gotten out of control. The sun is forcing every single planet to share an orbit, which will soon destroy everyone. What? Oh, He's no. not insane! Hold on. Are you suggesting we actually seek the rogue planets? Nobody knows what they are or what they want. But what I do know is that my planet is in danger. The Earth, Mars, Venus, everyone, they're all at the mercy of a totally deranged sun. And they're not enough to deal with him. The sun may be crazy, but at least we know him. We can't say the same about the rogue planets. We must take the risk. It's the only way to save everyone. Gong, gong, gong. I agree. Me too. <sighs> so be it. Are we doing this or not? Uh, what are we doing? Leaving the solar system. 
What else? Okay, can you repeat everything again? So, you happy? Me? Why? Didn't you want a grand adventure? Yeah, Pluto. And now we're getting the adventure of a lifetime outside the solar system. Oh, uh, yeah. But to be quite honest, I was looking forward to a break after the last one we had. Come on, Seriously? Pluto. Seriously? You're kidding, right? Shh. Guys, not so loud. I'm trying to hear what they are saying. Oh, the new dwarf planets? Technically, none of these new guys are officially dwarf planets. At least not according to the International Astronomical Union, since they haven't recognized them as such. How do you know this kind of stuff? Uh. <sighs> They're trying to listen to our conversation. Of course they are. Come on. Gung, gung, gung. Same here. We spent our entire lives guarding the solar system from outside invaders, and now we're actually looking for them? It's not like we have a choice. Yes, we do. Gun? If things are as dire as we think they are, then sure, let's ask the rogue planets for help. But... If the rogue planets pose a threat, as we've always suspected, then this is a chance for us to look at the enemy from up close. <laughs> Good thinking, Sedna. Should we tell the others about this? Tell us what? Ah! You! W -w were you? Hey, Quawar, can I ask you about your rings? They're far outside your Roche limit. That's super rare. Uh. Okay, everyone gather round. This is not a school trip, okay? This is life or death. So from now on, you do exactly as I say. You all got that? Someone's kind of bossy. Yeah, we'll put her in charge. Now, since the sun is distracted with his planet drama, and we're far enough for him to see us, I guess it's time we speed this up. Ha! Huh, so cool! Except we can't possibly go any faster without breaking the... the, uh... the laws of... of... physics. <laughs> you catch on quick. This? is the best day of my life!